Hello everyone, I'm Tirmik and today I'm going to show you how I made this, which is controlled by my phone. This project is about controlling a relay board uh, through Bluetooth with an Arduino. So it, uh, it takes command from um, uh, takes command from the Bluetooth through my phone to the Arduino, sends it, commands the relay board which opens and closes the circuit to which opens and closes the circuit to to light these light bulbs. Today I have only uh, a board of four relays, so I can only control these control these lights. Uh, in the next video I'll be making uh, a board with uh, eight relays or four to complete uh, this uh, whole project. So this will be um, to activate a neon, a neon light and these three uh, plugs. Let me show you how it works. We switch it. Let me get you closer. A 12 volt transformer, which takes uh, it takes 220 volts and turns it into 12 volt continuous uh, current. So it then goes to it then goes to every um, to every light bulb connection. Then from the light bulb connection, it goes back to the to the relay board. Each each light bulb has its own uh, relay that connects to and this is the relay board I'm talking about it controls up to uh, four switches so we can only uh, uh, control four uh, can only control four items then from the board it, uh, uh, it takes which takes power 5 volts and ground from the uh, from the Arduino from the regulator of the Arduino and these four, four inputs go to uh, digital, uh, the digital pins, uh, pins in the Arduino we have four of them and here, I don't know if you can actually see it this one is the Bluetooth module it's connected to the uh, RX and TX pins of the Arduino and it takes command from this from this app, as you can see when I turn the LEDs flash. So uh, this whole project started when I found this app, which called uh, ArduDroid by uh, TechBitar, I think. Uh, it's a very, a very nice app uh, as it can uh, control uh, all the pins of the Arduino. You can even send data and get data out of it if you have sensors on from the analog pins and it also controls the PWM signal so it is very versatile and um, comes very handy when you are uh, uh, troubleshooting and testing your, uh, your apps and your Bluetooth model so this uh, would be all uh, once I complete the, uh, the relay board I'll be switching to my, to my relay board which will be come in the next video we turn it back. See you next time.